When did I decide to call myself an artist? For a long time I used to say painter, because I thought artist was a bit stuck up somehow. But I'm not just a painter, I, I'm an artist, I think like an artist. And I'm, I feel really lucky that I'm, I've got to a point in my confidence where I can see that and, and be that. Um, well, it varies, obviously, but it is quite an organic process. I call it composting, and I just start reading and seeing and doing again. Spending time in the studio, but just doing fun little projects. And then when I feel I've got my feet planted again back in my head, then I start scratching at my canvases again and then I start understanding what type of surfaces I want to work on because I don't always work on canvas. Sometimes I work on tiles, sometimes I work on wood um, and obviously the paint slips on the surface differently with each thing so I have to figure out what mood I'm in again for a new body of work. I love working a surface in an interesting way and I love playing with slippages and I love mingling colour together on the same brush and then the surfaces are much thicker and heavily worked. I always have to stop myself at some point, make sure that it remains and so I don't over overcharge it, you know. I remember walking around my house with my camera, uh, taking pictures of things for Gumtree just to, just to sell stuff so that I could survive this lifestyle. But I gave myself five years in which to desperately fail. Um, and there was no way I could pull out of it. And, and this last show that I had in February was my pretty much five year anniversary, I suppose. And it was such a great success. And I felt like at last I was painting how I wanted to paint. And I was saying the things I really wanted to say. And of course, not the best work I'll ever do, but at that point, it felt wonderful. Thank you.